What's up, my evergreen friends? I'm Forest Boy, and welcome back to the most groovy game ever, Earthbound. All right, let's see what our friend Dungeon Man has in store with us for us. Even though you can't get up there now, you might be able to later. Brick Road, A.K.A. Dungeon Man. Keep this board in mind. <laughs> okay. Oh. I always try running away, but I do bad. The mystical record is in its cohorts. The mystical record in its cohorts opening attack. The mystical record is attacking. Five damage to Jeff. Scalding coffee cup spilled some scalding hot espresso. Four damage. Ninety-four damage. Whoa, whoa, whoa. With this protoplasm sizing up the situation, the worthless protoplasm feels a little strange. To think, just a little while ago, I couldn't speak at all. Now I'm actually doing well. PSI Fire Omega! Omicron! I decided that a while ago. Hmm. 137 damage to the mystical record! PSI Fire Omicron! 239 damage to the mystical record! The mystical record stopped moving! 107 damage to the Skull and Coffee Cop! 250 damage to the Borthus Protoplasm! Didn't. haven't I dealt with these before? Like I said, the most groovy game ever. This is interesting. I've tried doing certain games that don't interest me, and I'm completely low energy, but now I'm playing a game that I really love, and I'm really high energy. That is fascinating. Your first goal is to reach the four ropes. Brick Road. Okay, thank you, Brick Road. Let's see what I can do. What's this? You have a long way to go. Getting some rest and relaxation may save you. But you already gave... How big is Dungeon Man? How big is this place? There's useful I'm at the den and after you make quite a long walk. Big road. There's a cup of life noodles inside. Paula takes it. I love life noodles. Noodles are life if you make them correctly. You know what? I will heal. I'm scruffy. <laughs> I'm not too scruffy, I'm a little scruffy. While you explore the dungeon, why don't you make a pit stop? Big road. I wonder why I'm in this restroom right here. Just who am I? What is life all about? Oh, I'm sorry, did I make you nervous? I'm not dangerous, don't worry. <laughs> sure. I find thinking too much to be dangerous, so you are dangerous to me. You were just sitting there, and we snuck up on you. What? I built a bulletin board without a message. Well, isn't the message that you have no message, so... The grass is always greener on the other rope. I wonder why that is. Oh, do I have to do a riddle? The grass is always greener on the other rope. I wonder why that is. The grass is always greener on the other rope. I wonder why that is. The grass is always greener on the other rope. I wonder why that is. I'll just try one at random. Learn from your mistakes. Follow this and you're bound to be successful in Earthbound. Brick Road. How could you know these things? Is Brick Road truly the game developer? Ah. I burnt my tongue. It still hurts. This is the second floor of my body. Brick Road. What's a dungeon? That is my eternal question. A dungeon, by definition, is... I don't have a dictionary, so I'm just gonna ad-lib. A, dun a, a dungeon, by definition, is a building or other such place that is maze-like and has many different traps, puzzles, and potential dangers and other such things. I think I did pretty good. You are standing right around my belly button. 
Brick Road. What? This music is one of my greatest accomplishments. <laughs> he commented on his own music. On his own dungeon's music. This is... I am happy now. There is an item at the dead end, but I have been known to be wrong occasionally. Sorry. So all of those are dead ends? Do you know? It smells like flowers here. If you can't smell it, your nose must be stuffy. Brick Road. Okay, upsy doopsy. Downsy doopsy. Dungeon exploration is tough, but it's also fun. Brick Road. There's a sudden guts pill inside. Paula takes it. Hmm. I love dungeon raiding. Hey! There's a pizza inside, but he's got too much stuff already. Hmm. Alright, so. How about we ditch the neutralizer? Because. What is the neutralizer anyway? If only Joey were here! When used during battle, the item resets the abilities of all creatures, friend or enemy, to their normal levels. Any changes that have taken place due to PSI and such is neutralized. It also neutralizes all shields, friend or enemy, that were in effect. Remember the abilities that I am talking about are offense, defense, guts, etc. Pizza good. Alright, what's up here? There are lots of monsters up there, but don't stress out. Freak road. Open the present. There is a PSI caramel inside. Hmm. Should. I will eat you. This is vitality. Went up by one. Alright. PSI Carmel, that's very good if we need a quick boost of PSI power. I wonder if this would make a good kind of movie. This is the third floor... Third... <laughs> Whoa, ducky duckies! Mad duck, they can be a nice pet if they stay far away. Brick Road! <laughs> Whoa! It's like a zoo! Gruff goat, they are a really gruff kind of goat. From Brick Road. <laughs> He's a man of few words. And thoughts. Slimy little pile. He has a bad habit of burping. Brick Road. Uh, let's see. What is, what's else in, in the zoo? There's a wet towel inside. I don't need that. Good night, Binch. May you relax and recover your health and spirits. I was trying to check the sign, but okay. Why don't you take a nice little rest here? Brick Road! <sighs> okay. Um, I'm worried about the holes in the ground. Good job, you finally made it! There is a board upstairs that says that. Okay, so one more floor then? I'm not... You finally made it! <laughs> that face is mine. Feel free to talk to it. So you really have become Dungeon Man. Welcome! Long time no see. Mr. Jeff, we met in Winters a long time ago. I'm Brick Road. Doctor and Donuts finally made me Dungeon Man! If you want, I'll come with you guys for a while. The return hole over the is over there. Jump in that hole and then walk out. Cool! So how does Dungeon Man follow? My god! Are we jamming some new groovy stuff? We are! Since I'm dealing in some pretty rough stuff, I can't run my business in town. See ya later. Come on, Dungeon Man! I assume Dungeon Man won't help us out in battle. Marauder Octobot. I can't remember what level this is. 62 to okay, they're stronger. 141 damage to a high class UFO. I smash! The US 
high class UFO shield disappeared. High class UFO dodged quickly. Dungeon man attacks the Marauder Octobot. Dungeon man. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. Super painful. The high class UFO fired a beam. Pull it dodged. Jeff attacks. 148 damage to the high class UFO. The high class UFO was destroyed. PSI freeze Omicron. 174 damage to the Marauder Octobot. Nest tried PSI Rock and Beta. 132 damage to the Marauder Octobot. Dungeon Man attacks. 345 damage to the Marauder Octobot. The Marauder Octobot was totally scrapped. You won! I feel like it. I feel like a winner with that one. Dungeon Man, you're awesome! Can I grind with Dungeon Man? If he's gonna help me out with big boom bang punches. Oh, Paula's half dead. Uh, I'm gonna need to fix that in a second. 80 damage to Jeff. Dungeon Man attacks the Marauder Octobot. Dodge quickly. Maybe he's not very accurate. Maybe I shouldn't do that. The Marauder Octobot was totally scrapped. This background kind of makes me dizzy. Okay, so... Hmm. What, what, what? There's something over here? Oh no, I am... Getting caught in the palm trees! Mm, I cannot move! Well, if I cannot move, it is okay. Yes, it makes me sad, but I must say goodbye here. At my eternal resting place. Aww. I believe it is impossible for me to move from this spot. Do not worry about me. Please continue on. I'm... <laughs> I'm stuck! I am not happy! Can I go in anyway? Paul used the key to the tower, but nothing happened. Ah, oh, I want to go back in Dungeon Man. Okay, it's kind of hot. It's a little roasty toasty. Hello. A scary place called Deep Darkness is on the other side of the river. The monsters are very strong and you can lose your health just by wandering in the swamp. Do you want to cross the river, even though you know it's a stupid idea? Yes. The swamp is bottomless. Even if you're swimming, you'll be dragged in. It is a different story if you have a submarine. Ah! I have a heat stroke. What? You stop doing that. I know Omicron healing can heal Paula, but we can't do that right now. We just need to get out of this. Right now. Right here. Nearly missed hitting the target. Wow. Oh, baby! Offense went up by three, defense went up by two, guts went up by two, vitality went up by one, IQ went up by two, luck by went up a dip, dip. <laughs> a submarine? I believe that I have one in my old vehicle collection. Please enter. You do? Oh, hold on. I need rest. Good night, bench. May you relax and recover your health and spirits. So, your old collection of where? Of, uh huh? Where am I going? Where am I really going? I went the wrong way. No problem here. I couldn't agree more with the opinion on the left billboard. Alright. Don't be a slacker. If you work hard, you'll get good stuff. Road. Let's open the present. There is a super plush bear inside. Paula takes it. Sweet! You'll take damage for us for a little while. Whoa! Look at this background! This is cool! I like this one. This one makes me happy. The lesser mook. Didn't I fight you back in Foreside? The lesser mook glared with his eerie eyes. It did not work on the super plush bear. Just missed! Jeff attacks! 136 damage to the Lesser Mook. The Lesser Mook was defeated. 
Weren't you the one that was like a super annoyingly bad boss, but then it turns out you could just be defeated with one blast of PSI Flash? Fire? I put out a bulletin board, but it's probably unnecessary. It's only unnecessary if you have no way to make it necessary. So yes. There's a home down below. You don't have to worry about this for now. Rick Road. Where? Why? Ow. Hello again, face. There's an old submarine at the back of the dungeon. It can be used across the river. There's a goodbye exit over there. It will take you to the submarine. Don't make a mistake on which exit you take. You need to take the goodbye exit. Hope to see you again. Okay, so the goodbye exit was over here. Correct? Alright. This is good. I can do. Woo! Okay, just gonna keep going. Mushrooms? Yay! Happy mushrooms! Okay, uh, the present? There's a talisman ribbon inside. Politics? What is that? Because that sounds cool. Talisman ribbon, miscellaneous equipment that can only be used by Paula. When equipped, luck is increased. Hmm. Foot! Ooh, that's a big boost in luck. Mushrooms? Empty box? Okay, here comes nothing. <laughs> they, they, they knew better. I set up a telephone line in the dungeon. I wonder if that's controversial. What? <laughs> okay, now this is your dad. I deposited Taking away your spin, you should now have the and then count. Well, anyway, what do you need from me? Do something. And do. Okay. I knew this was the first time I saved, I knew that was going to get old. Old vehicle collection. This is my secret hobby. Brick Road. Taxi with no engine. Beautiful, even though the thing doesn't run. Brick Road. This is a gift from Dr. N. Donuts. Be careful how you use it. What do you mean? Rusty bicycle. Rust is the perfect break. <laughs> okay. Broken down old submarine. The yellow color is purely coincidental. It's a yellow submarine! Wait a minute. Wait! A minute! It's THE yellow submarine from the Beatles! It can still work. This will be the second Beatles, Beatles reference. In the town where I was born lived a man who sailed to sea and he told us of his life in the land of submarines so we sailed into the sun till we found the sea of green and we lived beneath the waves in our yellow Submarine. Hmm. Are you a phone? Ring, ring. <laughs> More good music. I love Earthbound. And look, monkeys galore. Wait a minute. Last time I, there was a whole bunch of monkeys around, I was actually really annoyed. Because they kept asking me for stuff. Like a, one of those annoying fetch quest sort of stuff. Hello. The monkeys run the inn at the forest. You can stay here for free. I will spend. You're sure to have fond memories of the monkeys then after your trip. <laughs> can Mr. Magic Cameraman appear? Don't do you think it was comfortable? Take care and goodbye. Wait a minute. It's. Aww. Eh. Eh. No problem here. Oh, wait, I can't leave. Oh. 
I don't have a map either. No problem here. Oh, God. <laughs> ah, we're dying. Da, we need to learn how to swim because that's not good. Oh. <laughs> What's up, buddy? Shh, don't talk too loud. What do you want? I've got what you need. A combat yo-yo. Uh... Nope. Uh... I want to know who this guy is. I've seen him several times and I still don't know what he does and why he does it. Uh, lucky coin. I'll give you $3,000 for it. Just pocket cash. You know, I carry around just massive amounts of money all the time. Here. I... <laughs> so, what's the policy on PSI teleport? I can teleport back to deep darkness. What happens if I try teleporting through the water? Woo! Cool. Because I need to go store a whole bunch of stuff and I don't want to deal with the whole phone thing. Okay. Hey, ay Stop tree. Stop tree. Tree wasn't doing anything. I want to go check up on Pokey too. Name it no. Yes. What was his name? I don't remember. Hello, Shimmy. I don't want to go out anymore. I don't care if everyone thinks I'm a stubborn mutt. Hey, little sis. Oh, that's my line now. Oops. What do you want me to do? Store some stuff. Okay. Store a snake. I. T <laughs> um. Store my key to the tower. All right, time to get chill. Time to get chill. <laughs> You're back. Don't bother yourself with talking now. You look too tired. Mothers understand these things. Eat some chili and scoot up to bed. All three of you in the same bed. Uh, okay, good. I always feel like sometimes... You know what? I'm actually going to raise it up a little. There we go. Because sometimes when I can't see it in my periphery vision, my little microphone, I get worried that I forgot to bring it down, and the audio quality is going to come out terrible. <laughs> what are you doing? Good night. Sleep tight. Farewell. Why is it always nighttime? How is it always nighttime when I call him? Is he. It's dad. in purgatory? <laughs> and you're flying backwards. You don't. <laughs> you don't do that. That's not normal. Don't I remember something about the secret club? <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that, but I want to say hello to him. Ness, I'm doing watch out duty for the hideout. Can you take over? You're busy. I understand. Good. You still understand. I love how I was just hidden in trees. I'd like to go on an adventure with you once I become a little stronger. Love! You've grown since I last saw you. You're beginning to look like a man. You're so cool. I think I really like you. Well, you know what I mean. <laughs> ah, I missed Onet. It's good to be back. Okay. Time to do PSI teleport back to wherever we were. To the deep darkness. I did it! I didn't mean to do that. I want to become a pig. If I become a pig, I can find the mushrooms called magic truffles. They're located in the swamp and can be found by scent. You know, a pig's nose would be enough to find those great truffles by scent alone. 
This is the deep darkness. When you walk through the swamp, you endanger your health. You can't help it. That's why it's called deep darkness. Hold on. Hey, what you doing? I don't feel it's necessary for us to talk. Who are these people? Hi, how are you? I'm not a bad guy. I came from one of the world's largest economic powers to this small rural village. A businessman that's really tough has to travel this far for the best opportunities. And I'm a tough businessman, yes sir. I'm also representative of the doctor over there. A, do you want to buy? B, do you want to heal? Needless to say, this is a rural village. <laughs> we have poor items. Hello there, how may I help you? You talk way too much. Um, I will... a bottle of... rip... of noodles. A bottle of noodles. Thank you. No. Go away, you, you weird, weird man. I heard monkeys living in some desert can teleport. Oh yes, you learned how to teleport from the monkeys? I want to try. Will you tell me how to do it? Okay, I'll try it. <laughs> Knew that was going to happen. I'll never give up. I want to try again. Never abandon your dreams. All right, then. Where'd you go? I did it. Did you see me? That's awesome. Here's a small gift to thank you. Ness got the monkey's love. Is that really an item? It is. Monkey's love, a gift from a monkey. It can be used during battle. I will try it someday. Ah, I'm drowning. Oh, tis darkness. There's a banana inside. Politics. Hold on. Um, Hawkeye. There we go. Is somebody having problems? Hello? Shh, be quiet. I look very important, but I'm not really. I'm a cash dispenser man. If you want to withdraw cash, I'll charge you a handling fee, which is the same amount as your withdrawal. No! What? I don't understand that. What? Problems? Zapulin's cohort. Here's Zapulin's cohort's opening attack. Zapul used an electrical shock attack. I need a need Mr. Saturn coin. No, what's it called? The Franklin badge. <laughs> this is really groovy. Really chill groove. 426 damage to the Zapiel. Zapiel became tame. Jump attacks, 134 damage. Even a slimier little pile. <laughs> Peace out, Rockin' Beta. 159 damage to the even slimier little pile. Even slimier little pile is attacking, just miss. The even slimier little pile was defeated. <laughs> Everything is amazing in this game! <laughs> Okay, we will do... Whoa! Hey! Don't! <laughs> hmm, the hostile Elder Oak. Dude! Look at this shiny background. I really wish I had a map. I wish, I wish, I wish. Eh! Eh! Ah. Oh, that looks like a big froggy. Oh, no, it's not a frog. It's a friggin' alligator. That's not good. Ah, uh, there's a beef jerky inside. Ness takes it. Bippity, bippity. Okay, I'm just gonna scoot over here. Don't mind me. Hey, Takatu! How you doing? Magic Cameraman! I knew it the moment it stopped! Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready, say, Fuzzy Pickles! Fuzzy Pickles! 
<laughs> wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. <laughs> Dear God. Ah! Village Tindas comes nobody. Far. It's because. What? <laughs> oh, are you doing a Yoda thing? Do you speak backwards? Nobody comes to Tinda's village because it's far. Quick! I can't slip back to. Whoa, you're terrifying. I'm kind of getting hungry. 410 damage to Zapiel. It became tame. 109 damage to the hard crocodile. Smash! 496 damage to the hard crocodile. The hard crocodile became soft. <laughs> Nessa's friends gained a lot of H -E -X -P. H -E -X -P. A special hot EXP. I wonder if Pokey's just stuck in the cockpit. It's completely broken. I thought I could fix it, but on re-examination, I noticed that there's no engine. Hmm. Ness opened the present. There is a cup of life noodles inside. Jeff takes it. Nessa's HP are maxed out. I'm not as damaged as I think I am. Oh, okay then. That's not good. So, the demonic petunia. Yee. 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 Okay, so. Edge closer. That didn't work. <laughs> okay, good. We didn't even give it a chance to attack. A. I don't even know where we're going. What? Hey! The pit bull slug! <laughs> okay. Yeah, you know what? Okay then. Jeff attacks! 194 damage to the pit bull slug A! PSI Fire Omicron! It does! 236 damage! And it became tame! 222 damage! It became tame. 255. It became tame. Well, the only thing we're losing is Pee Pee. Otherwise, we're doing fine. Oh, and you became a stronger boy. Okay, what's in here? There's a souvenir coin inside. Nest takes it. Must be equipped it as other. Increases your defense and luck. Ooh, cool. I'll take that. I don't even know what that is, but I don't like it. Ah, oh, man. Making my life all hard and stuff. You can to the even slimier little pile in his cohort. The manly fish! Okay, uh, um... <laughs> Yeah, give it a good whack. 125 damage to the manly fish. 144 damage to the manly fish. Jab with a spear. 100. No, not the plush bear. Oh, good! PSI Freeze is, like, the main thing that works. There are a few things where it doesn't work, like the demonic platoon... Yet? Don't! Did you just burp at us? Oh, that's not cool. Like, the demonic petunia, the, the PSI Freeze didn't work on that, but in a lot of cases it works. Ooh. 
cool. No, it's a dead end! It's a completely dead end. Dead as a doornail! 153 damage to a big pile of puke. Ew. If that's how you're gonna be... Somebody hit... Woo! Jeff finally stopped crying. <laughs> 86 damage to the big pile of puke. The big pile of puke was defeated. That's a little hard to say. Hmm. <laughs> Alright. Uh, yay! Wait a second. We need healing. Uh, I feel like he's gonna be the boss. You may have forgotten, but uh, I'm the return of Belch! I fought you before. Don't you remember my right boater? Belch has trained more and has returned much stronger. Bleh. To puke! Barf! Vomit! Barf! Barf! Chuck! Chuck! Drown to death in puke! Great. Master Barf has... <laughs> uh, I need everything I can do here. Ness's body was protected. 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 Do, 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 do. Did not work on Master Barf. Master Barf burped and blew his nauseating breath at you. Hmm. Paralysis. Yuck. Ugh, you're pretty annoying. Oh. Oh. Not work on Master Barf. If only I had that fly honey on me. Okay, let's see if this does. Burped and blew his nausea and brother you. Jeff felt somewhat nauseous. Jeff is down. PSI Rock and Omicron. I have new tricks of my sleeve. PSI Freeze Omega. Uh, okay then. I guess we just go for it. Try PSI Freeze Omega! Master Barf's body solidified. PSI Rockin' Omicron! Suddenly, Joey swooped down from the sky! Joey uses new power! PSI Star Storm! Whoa! Master Barf was defeated. Joey! Joey has returned! Oh, that is amazing! Inside the present, there was a cat. Casey Bat! Ness took it. Pause levels now 52. Oh, baby! Okay, um. Joey! Joey! Hold on, I might still have those life noodles. Two, Paula. Right. That was the wrong person. Give me that rock candy. <laughs> Give me that PSI caramel. I don't know if that's enough, but we can try. Jeff was revived! Cool. Joey, you can help! It's good to have the team back together. I was just starting to miss you, man. Okay, let's see what's back here. Whoa. Whoa! Knock that off. I do look at me just slipping through there. It's like Metal Gear Solid. Just slipping through. No one even knows that I'm here. I just disappear. Whoa. Cool. 
land. Okay. Hello. Where shy? Where shy? What is that, a TV? Weird junk. No problem here. No problem here. No problem here. Well, let's see here. There's a death ray inside. Wow! That's weird. Okay, this would massively boop up, boop up my my offense. You know, the, the only kind of boost you want is a boop. Oh, okay. That sounds like a Jeff weapon. There we go. That's a nice boop, too! <laughs> Can we have a boop? <laughs> Hello? Are you a boop? We're all shy. Rumor? I heard a book to fix shyness there is. Where? Don't know. Just a rumor. You guys are so cute! Not as cute as the Saturns, but... We're shy. <laughs> no problem here. Hotel here. We're shy. <laughs> Hot springs. Good all over. Ah, yes. Just root around in the relaxing steam. Can we hurry it up, please? Resting well in the hot spring healed you. Sort of. Didn't fix that. Item shop here. We're shy. <laughs> They're so cute. I've never seen these before. Shy. That we are. <laughs> There's only one Tinda who's not shy. It's me, Bubby. You know what? There's something scary that comes from the underground. So we covered up the hole. There are lots of dinosaurs there. Went there once, but I came right back because I was so surprised. There was a talking stone that talks a lot. Do you want to go and see? I understand, but I'm not as strong as I look. <laughs> I'm sorry, I guess I can't help you. The guy next to me is strong, but he lacks conversation skills. It's to overcome his shyness first. Hmm, a book to overcome shyness. I don't need that, personally. <laughs> I'm very confident. In the hole, in we have. Free, stay. Okay, you stay. I'm just going to look at the wall. <laughs> oh, okay, we literally just slept in a cave. <laughs> okay, you're different, somehow. We're all shy. Rumor I heard about a book day fix. Shyness there is. Where? Don't know. Just a rumor. Hmm. I'm gonna check out the iron shop. We're shy. We're shy! <laughs> Not much of an item shop. No problem here. No problem here. Well, okay then. I guess I'll end the episode. I feel incomplete. Because I want to know more. <laughs> more jamming music. Uh... Okay then, Earthbound, lovely as usual, crazy as always. So, until next time, this has been a super shy forest boy, and this has been Earthbound. Stay fresh, stay green, and stay sappy, and I'll see you next time at Forest Boy Productions.